I apologize for the confusing post last night. It showed an old 24F, a new 24F, and a 31M all lined up on the floor of Batteries Plus. My intention was after my four-year-old X2 Power had decided that it didn't like sitting for more than two or three days without almost dying and needing a jump, that I was going to upgrade to a 31M. So I went ahead and used the 10% off for, for Batteries Plus and got myself a 31M. But these AGM batteries come with a free replacement warranty. And I'm used to the old batteries, like the old lead acid, non-AGM batteries that you just get a prorate and just get some money off the next battery. So I brought the old battery down to Batteries Plus and I thought, you know, okay, I'll get some money off this 31M that I just purchased, maybe get a refund for my core charge, not a big deal. So the guy at Batteries Plus told me that, you know, you do it for your battery replacement. Right, here's my 31M that I wanna buy, let's do that. Well, you can't, the free battery replacement is one for one. You have to get back the equivalent battery that's under warranty. So in the post that I made last night, I show the old battery, a new 24F battery, and a new 31M battery. I really didn't need to be taking two batteries home that day. So since the 24F was free, and I didn't really have the option to use that money towards a new 31M, I went ahead and came home with group 24. In the end, I'm gonna to wanna to have that group 31, but I need to figure out what I'm gonna do with this 24F. The prevailing idea is obviously I could sell it. However, it's not gonna come with a warranty since this is a warranty replacement. As you can see, we're keeping it on a charger and we're keeping it topped off so that it can be used either in the trailer or somebody else can have it. If you guys have any other suggestions of what we can do with this extra AGM battery that we have, let us know. Cheers.